Good morning YouTube, what's going on? This is Enderman's End and today we are going to continue building on the wind hand build and usually I do this with a timeless video and you are currently hopefully seeing a timeless video of me building the uh, the, the wind hand thing but I have had some problems with the recording so it will stop in about one minute and uh, I usually record on my computer, I play Minecraft on the computer and record with um, a second Minecraft account and uh, on, my, on my laptop and for some reason it didn't want to record, it stopped after four minutes or so every time, so I really couldn't figure out what the problem was. Um, I've just clean installed Windows 10 and there was enough space on the hard drive, so I don't really know what went wrong, but um, so yeah, I've, well, I haven't been building for quite a while now because I was slightly pissed because of that, but uh, I thought we could do it with like the, the build lock thing that I've tried with Orkish Village, Village and so yeah, the, let's uh, actually go to the part that I've already done in the timeless video. So um, this episode was actually going to be about the, the, the big palace and well, I've at least finished the gate here and I've done some parts over there, but it's, as you can see, really not um, done. And I have Skyrim up and running on my laptop right now next to me, so I can take a look at that. and. Yeah, so let's actually start with this part here, because this is the one that we maybe could start with. And I have no idea how, how this is supposed to look, so I'll take a look at the at Skyrim for now. So the beginning of those um, building sessions is always quite a bit difficult, because I have to look a lot at the game uh, at Skyrim and try to figure out how it could be, or how it should be in uh, Windhelm to get in, in, in Minecraft to get the... Um, to get the size right and I think that this one is already at the right size let's take a look at uh, it's quite awkward sitting on two computers at once uh, I think that is the right height here so there's going to be a roof right now and the roof is made out of the same material as the other roofs which is some dark blocks so let's see all right maybe we should start with extending this wall by a bit and there needs to be a pillar over here and the pillar is made out of something like that I think here. So this is one of the reasons why I usually do timeless videos of uh, the, the Windheim build or why I did do that because it takes forever to figure takes me forever to figure out how to do it. So there's this pillar over here and now I have to move the mouse again. Usually I work with screenshots which make it a lot easier because then I don't have to move the mouse but think it will work so there's that and we need to put on the roof and let's build the wall here first so actually it's really nice right now to um, build again because I have been um, doing some plugin de development again lately and I was running on Minecraft 1.9 on a on a default server that doesn't have any plugins so it's quite nice to actually build the wall with uh, commands like I did over here um, it's quite a lot easier than doing it per hand. Okay, so in Skyrim there is a really awkward part over here that I'd like to not build because that looks quite a bit bad. So let's instead extend this by one block like that and then we'd have to move this up here. So in, uh, in, in Skyrim there is this part here striking through the wall which looks really weird and I'm not going to do that here. That might work. Let's take a look from it from far away. Ah, it's not really high enough, is it? So it's um, somewhere half of this roof over there. So that's how I've done quite a lot of building here. So I've started somewhere and then took a look at the size of that building and then from the size of the buildings that I've already had, uh, uh, determined the size of the other buildings that I had to build. Um, that didn't always work out very well, but uh, most of the time it did somehow. Alright, the next part is a bit difficult to rebuild because it is, has to be a bow, somewhat that goes like that. And I will try... I'll try to do it with stairs, but it might... Well, you can't really see it. So this is the part where the proportions don't work very well because the wall here is too short, actually. Um, yeah. Not actually sure about the inside of the palace, if you can enter this part here or not. 
because in Skyrim the buildings are uh, different on the outside and, and on the inside than they are on the outside. And there should be the windows, so let's see if we can throw in another type of stairs and then put glowstone there. I've done it over, I've used this uh, quite simple technique over here, I think, somewhere. Ah, uh, did I? Why did I do it? I think it was inside that building to get the look of the... Yeah, there I did it. Alright. We've placed stairs first, uh, uh, windows first, and then, then the glowstone. Yeah, that is at least the look that I wanted to create, but um, unfortunately I can't keep those blocks there and it doesn't connect to the stairs. And then it's still... No, that looks... <sighs> See, this is the part that I don't like about the windows in Minecraft. And um, the, 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 the other things as well, the iron bars, they have the same problems. So let's take another look at this. Hmm. I don't like the windows, but I don't like the glowstone as well, so... We might have to go with the glowstone though, because there's not much we can do with the windows to fix those. Alright, so I've covered up everything with glowstone right now, and I don't like the glowstone down there, so I'll remove those. And replace them with... Uh, let's go for the no normal stones. And I've used them quite a lot actually because they don't look too bad in the Conquest texture pack. No, that's not really looking good. Good, but maybe I can throw in another stair. Uh, like that. Um, maybe the other way around. So I've been using quite a lot of stairs actually in this build here because they do add in quite a lot of nice little details. Let's take a look at the original. The original doesn't have anything at the end here, so I'll just try and build something simple like that. Nah. Yeah, that will do. Alright, so there's the first bit here. And we still need to do this part here. Maybe we could start, whoops, maybe we could start with this thing here. Alright, so the pillar ends, or the, this uh, walkthrough ends probably over here. Alright, so I have used the uh, cobblestone walls to um, give this more of a, a better shape. It still looks really high, but it is like that in the original as well, which is weird. I mean, why would someone build such a, um, a high walkthrough? Um, so maybe... Hmm, I'm thinking about how what we could do in the inside, but let's do this part here first. Alright, the wall is made out of a different material than this one. I think there is um, a different cobblestone block that I've used over there, so let's try this one. But I don't remember what which one it was. And I think I can't grab it by pressing the middle mouse button, because then it will just give me the normal cobblestone. Hmm. So I will have to find out which one it is. Alright, the wall has to be here. Oh, that's actually interesting. What is that? That is a nice looking block. I didn't know that this one exists. Uh, let's grab um, this one really quick. Uh, it was the first cobblestone block. I didn't know that they have something like that. Let's see. Alright, that is really nice. I should have used that quite a lot more often. Ah, that looks nice. Um, I'll just leave it over here so that I remember that this exists and now let's go back to this one. So it wasn't the first one, it wasn't the second one, it was not the third one. I think it was this one. Alright, and maybe we can actually use this now. Uh, but let's see, there are first those really big pillars and we're going to make them out of this block here. So one is going to be here and the other one is going to be here I guess. And they nearly reach the roof so they are quite high. And maybe I should extend them by one block or maybe even by two blocks, I don't know. 
Alright, so there are two blocks, but I think I might want to do this one block lower. Um, so that it is differentiated from the roof up there. Yeah, that will do. And actually, let me qu uh, put on the roof really quick before we start building the the wall itself. Um, or at least make the wall look better. Alright, there's our roof for now. And it actually has to be replaced up there with another roof, but we'll do that later. And that it's, re it's really laggy from time to time. Maybe I should change the hard drive that I'm using for recording. But that's the thing that I'll do after I've uh, finished this episode. So let's add in more of the normal cobblestone block. And since we are having the replacer here we can actually use this one because that's maybe faster let's see so maybe we can try using it here did we actually get it mm. that looks a bit different than it did here oh because there are blocks on top of that uh, maybe I can use a stair to, to get the same effect but I'm not sure that doesn't work either, so alright, that is that is a bit disappointing now, but we can figure out something else. Oh, my timer is going on because I've tried to not make this episode longer than half an hour because then it might uh, be very long at the end. But um, let's actually finish this bit here first, and then I'll try to figure out why the hell the game is lagging so badly. Alright, so I've uh, finished off the wall by using a mixture of different stairs and the cobblestone types. And I've um, also noticed that I don't have a wall over here, but that's fixed now as well. It is uh, the same pattern as over there, but looks a bit weird because there are only two blocks of uh, space here. So uh, anyway, I've also added in those uh, cobblestone walls here to make it uh, uh, the, the, the corner look a bit better. Um, yeah, the roof is finished now, and I think that's it for the first episode already. So I will... Um, yeah, in the next episode we'll probably build the next part over there i guess and other than that i'd say thanks for watching and goodbye